what's cracking fam first and foremost i extend my utmost love and respect to all you guys i hope this video finds you doing well residing within the highest of spirits and just remaining positive pushing that that, that message of change and hope uh so you know i'm gonna make this a short video as you can see i'm on my bed i'm i'm, I'm on the laptop i'm doing leads and, and and booking jobs today that's the main focus is putting work on this calendar so we can keep grinding and making that money and supporting our families so uh you know i just want to shout out to all our vets this is veterans day weekend and i just want to give a big shout out to all of our vets all those who served in the military all those who paid the ultimate sacrifice of life and blood so we can sit here and enjoy these very freedoms that we're enjoying now like sitting here watching this video making this video um, you know there's so many things on a daily basis that people take for granted that so many people have paid life and blood for so we can enjoy and have and uh, you know it, it's you know it's a bittersweet thing you know and uh, shout out to all those who willingly you know put their lives on the line to go out and fight so we can be free and have a nation uh, um, that that affords us so many opportunities to uh, be great and succeed in life and and actually make something of our lives and become something you know so uh, shout out to all all of our vets and all who paid that ultimate price you guys are amazing and uh, you know it would be an honor to fight side by side with you and that's from the heart um, I do want to uh, read a couple quotes and speak on those quotes let me pull them up real quick um, so I, I'm a big uh, Abraham Lincoln was an amazing man uh, he, he was very knowledgeable very smart and uh, just just an amazing man so here's one quote here from Abraham Lincoln America will never be destroyed from the outside if we falter and lose our freedoms it will be because we destroyed ourselves Abraham Lincoln and that rings so true in so many different areas not just the political state of our country and and our nation as a whole but in everyday life you know it you know something outside of yourself does not have the power to destroy you I mean obviously we don't have the control over somebody coming up and and committing an act of violence against us and uh, and you know taking our life you know unexpectedly or you know a car accident or something of that nature but you know losing a job or not being able to find employment or or whatever the case whatever hardship you may be facing or that may happen in your life that does not have the ability to destroy you what does have the ability to destroy you is how you choose to deal with that situation if you choose not to deal with that situation according to right action and do the right thing then yes that can destroy you and you know it goes for our nation as well if we don't make the right moves politically you know and 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 we continue to make bad choices in the way we deal with other countries other nations uh, you know our trade deals so forth the economy you know it can it can destroy itself from within you know so that's one quote I wanted to share another one that I really like I will prepare and someday my chance will come Abraham Lincoln you know that's so true you know where you want to be in life you may not be there right now but what you can do is prepare for when that day does arrive an example a personal example and this is you know putting my personal business out there but my son you know he's in the county jail again he's in the Twin Towers and he's he's got some serious issues that he needs to deal with he's 23 almost 24 now and you know I don't know when he's gonna come around I've offered him help I've offered him you know the opportunity to come out here I'll get him into a program so he can you know make those necessary changes and you know I will be there with him every step of the way and if you know he does good gets out you know shows an effort wanting to work and, and, and to put forth that that you know that life of right action then I'll do whatever it takes to help him I'll get him a job whatever the case may be 
but obviously he's not ready. So all I can do is prepare myself for when that day does finally come. So you may not be sitting exactly where you want to be sitting in life, but as long as you're preparing for when that day comes, when it does come, you'll know exactly what to do and how to handle it, and you'll be prepared for that change in your life. So I got one more to share with you guys. The best way to predict your future is to create it. You have to put the changes that you want to make in your life forthright. You have to make that a priority. Nothing's just going to happen by you sitting around and doing any, nothing. You have, you have to put forth that effort to make that change. So I encourage everybody to do so. And shout out to all of our veterans. You know, all those who have been injured in, the, in, in, you know, in battle and that have come home, you know, and that have struggled through the hardships and have learned to adapt without limbs and, you know, and, and are making the best out of their lives. Shout out to those ones who are struggling from addiction because they came back and they just, they feel like they weren't being supported and they didn't have the right resources to help them with the issues they were having. So they, they turned to substances to try and help aid in the way they were feeling. Shout out to those that are hurting. We love you guys. You know, shout out to all the organizations that are fighting to help our, our vets and to make them, make, make, make things better for them in life and making sure they got the, the things given to them that they, they, that they rightfully are afforded, that they earned through sacrifice, through putting their life on the line for the freedoms of this country. We owe them. They paid their dues. They went far and beyond the call of duty. Shout out to all those who lost their lives. Our hearts go out to you. You will forever be loved and remembered. And our hearts go out to your families and your loved ones. Shout out to all the vets. My brother Colin is a vet. DC Irish is a vet. Jose, shout out to Jose. Shout out to Mundo Sepulveda, my brother. Shout out to all the vets that I know. If I forgot you, I apologize. But shout out to our veterans. Let's let's just you know this weekend. Let's focus and remember what this 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 holiday weekend is truly about. Yeah, cool. You know, go out barbecue, do your thing. But it's about remembering those veterans and showing love to those veterans. So shout out to the vets. We love you guys, and we thank you for fighting for our freedom and for giving us this platform that we have here today. Thank you for your service.